and welcome to Hearts of Iron 4, vanilla this time. So I decided that because a new version of Hearts of Iron came out not too long ago, that I should restart like the game, because eventually the Latvia save would have been uh, unplayable I think, eventually, maybe. Anyways, I find it safer to start a new game and also maybe show more the vanilla Hearts of Iron, because it is a bit different, vanilla versus with mods. So I am going to play vanilla, I'm not going to go major, instead I'm going to go to a pretty minor minor actually. Because Turkey you can form the Ottoman Empire and with Iran the Persian Empire, but Iraq? Not really anything. And that's because it's the weakest out of the three. It has the least resources. Turkey has a ton of chromium and Iran has like a ton of oil. You just have a little some oil. But you start out fascist and then with some weak neighbors. So we can well a bit of fascist support. But we're going to have to do a lot of things if we want to uh, really step up our game. Mostly, can we build some tanks? No. So we want to immediately research tank technology. Oh god, we don't have great war tank tech. So that's going to be important. We'll also want... Uh, probably... Basic machining tools. Civilian factories, I should want you to build some... Uh, how many military factories do we have? Not that many, so we want to build some military factories. Uh, actually, yeah, we do want to just set some military factories to be built, I guess. And that that's going to be good for now. Uh, national focus, I want to do political effort just so we can start the war as fast as possible but I think that our neighbors will just start with more troops so that's a problem but mm, let's go political effort what do we need to be produced just some okay F same thing for here yes manpower and infantry equipment so we're just going to train both of those in, I in Baghdad. Uh, we'll set these to be the main priorities. And I'll just put one for now. We also need some... Uh, we need... Oh, right. We need to trade some steel with the... I guess the United States. Yes, just so that we don't have that problem. You two should be under a commander. You... And you should just garrison that area. Because we actually have some close air support, so you guys can go in the Middle East and do that. So having 25 planes as close air support is probably going to help us a lot in conquering Saudi Arabia, which is obviously our first conquest target. Our next one actually... Eventually, it's going to either be Iran or Turkey after we get through Saudi, Yemen, and Oman. 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 I don't know if I've made that joke yet. Meh. Not really that important. Right now, we're going to need to consolidate our power. And also think about what we're going to do. Because chances are we're going to join the Axis. Hopefully, Iran and Turkey stay neutral. Or at least, if Turkey joins, well... Actually, if Turkey joins, that would be a problem, because if they join on the side of uh, the Soviet Union, or at least the allies in the Soviet Union join together, they're directly going to be at my border. But if I can keep them neutral, or even maybe flip them to the Axis side, that would be nice. Just so I have a buffer state between me and the Soviet Union. Because if I don't... Problems... Why aren't you going here? Fine. Okay. I'll change that. Go there. Better. That's the thing. I really hope that they fix the generals and the units. Okay, okay. 
political effort is done, we can change our government now. Now, industrial focus. So much industrial focus right now. Uh, we are going to also need to change some things like... Alright, fascist demagogue. We really need to get that fascist up fast. Go, go, go! Oh, Spain has started its civil war. As usual. This will make for something to watch, actually. While nothing happens over here. N seriously, though, nothing will happen over here for a while. Six to seven. Six, okay. And I think Republican Spain might be doomed. Meaning... If we can take over most of Africa, that would be nice. I have a feeling Italy will want this, but we can expand here too. And maybe even liberate Jordan, which would be nice. And maybe <laughs> Israel or Palestine. They set it up for the post-war, at least. But right now we have to pre prepare for the Great War. Or at least the Second Great War, that's what you would call it. Hmm. <laughs> Man, this is already growing. We're also going to need to research ideology soon. Well, not ideology, military theory. A lot of the things stay the same, but you can also see that the technology is less advanced than in modern day. Oh, that's our ideology done. Uh, I kind of want... let's do the armament effort. Then we'll want to do the civil factory effort. Okay. Kind of actually want to get concentrated industry. After we get the tank, we'll research uh, mobile. Huh. That's where we get our steel from. Hmm. Oh, we have two civilian factories open now. That's nice. Close to 25%? Or a quarter? Can't really declare on them though. And anyways, I'm pretty sure that they have more troops than us at this point. We need a lot more equipment. Like, a lot more units right now. Uh, backroom backstepper, entrenchment, close air support, actually close air support might be the best idea, but hmm, I could really use something like industrial concern. Let's do that, industrial concern. Now we need some tank divisions. We have enough oil to do it. Okay. Uh, we're going to want the mobile warfare doctrine. And I think, yep, it give me it gives me armored divisions automatically. Which I'm going to trade here, a train here, and put on highest priority. With we need some uh, equipment production for it too. But we're going to need that armament effort before we can do that. It isn't yet, yeah, highest priority, we need some light tanks. And we need more light tanks to be built. So I think maybe armament, maybe collectivist ethos, actually? If we can get one tank, I'm pretty sure we can overpower them. Let's get that collectivist ethos. We're soon going to get concentrated industry too, which is going to be a lot nice. Damn it, ahead of time. I feel I'm also going to want excavation and construction, so let's get that done. Come on, we need some tanks to be done. And we're producing tanks slowly. One per week. It's going to take us like 
a hundred weeks. Italy took Ethiopia. Actually, yeah, let's just look how Spain is doing. Oh, yep, nationalist Spain is wrecking, as usual, I guess. I wonder if in some scenarios nationalist Spain can declare war on Portugal. It would make sense to expand there, I guess. Hmm. Okay. So this is the setup. Next episode we should be able to declare war on Saudi Arabia and uh, wait, maybe not declare war, change government for sure. Right now we should get more armament and get that done. Oh yes. Could you please I hate it th this before but Please, okay, that, wait. What do you mean you have no over... <sighs> Damn it, incompetent generals. They still haven't fixed generals. I hate that I have to redo this each time. Anyways. Soon we should become fascist. If we could take over Saudi Arabia, Yemen, and Oman before the, great w the Second World War starts, it would all be very great, but I need a bit more of an army right now. I also need a lot more tanks. Gotta need more tanks. <laughs> Well, I need a lot of things, actually. Yeah, Iran beats us on the oil by a lot. Let's see here. Actually, you know what? Uh, I don't want to do that. Ideology during the fence. Let's. Mm. Damn it, uh... Motorized? We want a light, uh, tank. Yes, tank. We're going to want a tank, uh, company. To help us get some good tanks. Or at least some tanks. <laughs> some tanks, just some tanks, so that we can... Wreck all of the other states that don't have tanks yet. And also because we have a ton of oil. Oh right, we want to invade Turkey. Because look at that juicy, juicy chromium. But we need a lot of troops. Civil war? No, no, no. Unite the people first. We don't want to get into a civil war. I'm an effort. Get that done. And do that. Because we kind of need more of those right now. But let's get more construction effort. More nationalism focus. Hmm. Construction effort, then nationalism focus. Actually, what we could do is... Oh, no, we can't. Right now, we need to build those tanks. So, these guns can wait. More tanks! Yeah, they need more equipment. So get those tanks done. <sighs> Unite the people first. We don't want a civil war right now. So if we could get a coup d'etat and transfer to fascism without starting a war on ourselves, that would be great. But for now, we'll have to make do with that. So I hope you enjoyed the video. It's really a start just beginning with Iraq. Hopefully it's the start of a greater empire and also winning in Spain in Africa for Germany, but we'll see about that later. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment if you liked and well like if you liked actually. 
I don't know what to say more, actually. <laughs> Later.